All right, what is up guys? I just wanted to do a quick video on how to import an image into Carbide Create. So I just have this pre-selected image here. I'm just going to save this. So save image as, um, I'm just gonna save this as tree. Um, uh, we'll just save it as a tree. Um, I will come back to Carbide Create. And then so all we're gonna do, this is super easy. You can literally take anything really and just hit trace image, uh, tree three, trace image, okay, and look at that. Um, so that's all you do right there uh, and then shrink it down. And then what I like to do is I like to do um, tool paths. I go to advanced V carve and um, it's already set to the tool I like. And then we'll look at the simulation but yeah, just think about, this is how you import it, and then just think about how you know how you wanna go about, you know, the depth you wanna go and what tool you wanna use. Um, so yeah, here, let me do another one for you guys. We'll just look up, um, I like the black and white ones because it's easier to um, see the lines and all that, so let's do ice cream cone. Uh, all right, here, we'll do this one right here. So I'm gonna save image as, ice cream cone close enough um, back to carbide create go here trace image ice cream cone trace image boom look at that look at that and then I'll just bring it down pretty crazy pretty crazy right um, that looks good Advanced V-Carve, blah, blah, blah. Show simulation, look at that. Look at that, pretty cool, pretty cool. Um, so yeah, that's how you do it. You save the image as, go to trace image, pick your, pick your thing, pick your poison, hit trace image, hit okay, and then scale it. And then I like to use Advanced V-Carve to etch it out um, clearly.